as much as I would love to use the word art to describe what I'm about to show you, the unfortunate reality is that this is my own living hell. These words, this story, these events are not of any form of fiction aside from the recreation of this symbolic nightmare you are about to witness. I wish I could say I was creative enough to make this story up. Sadly, I am not. My grandfather died in this house face down on the floor where I stand. My immediate family resorted to abusive drug use, including myself. Heroin seemed to be the drug of choice, however, I did not run to heroin, but fought against an aggressive opiate addiction. After countless suicide attempts and overdoses from myself, my family, and my friends, some made it out alive and others did not. I am telling you this because I do not want people to feel sorry for me. I do not want your sympathy. I do not want your apologies. They mean nothing to me. I do not believe a higher power is out there guiding my soul because from what I know, I'm the only one who's ever picked myself up off the floor of hell. I do know for a fact that pure evil exists and it is after all of us and we must fight to the death or be enslaved by our own self weakness. I do not say these words for fame. I do not need your condolences. All I want to do is tell you to fight back. I am no one special and if I can survive this fairy tale of horror that I know to be my life, then I know you can too. This composition was written, performed, and recorded solely by me. Music has been the only thing in my entire life to save me, and I want to share what has saved and continues to save me with you. Challenge your demons and devils. You are stronger than you know. Come get us. We are waiting.
Yeah!